hello there welcome to my channel gear solid okay so i have with me here some very important blender add-ons which i have tried and i must say are really good i personally think these are one of those things every blender user needs right now at the moment my colleague and i are trying to set up a small um, production pipeline but replace one of the steps with blender so far it's not going well and from what i have come to notice personally i would say blender is very light and can't handle huge simulations trillions of polygons are also a problem and some other issues which i will take time to share in my um, upcoming videos that was just by the way now back to the add-ons these add-ons i'm about to share were packed together by booms a very good friend of mine who was very generous to share some of his free add-ons um, with me since blender is targeting more up and coming 3d artists i thought it would be cool to pack them and share them here for any beginner out there who wants to get more serious with blender kindly check the description below for the download links without wasting much time the number one is going to be flip fluid the flip fluid add-on is a tool that helps you render liquid simulation effects without struggle no matter the kind of machine you use you are able to create high quality cinematic fluid simulations without having to spend so much on acquiring a beefed up machine just to run blender as a beginner settings and options have been made way easier for any user to maneuver their way through without any difficulties which enhances the default capabilities of blender fluid simulation softwares can be intimidating complex and difficult to work with but you get used to it the more you use it, just like any other software or plugin. Comparing this free add-on to any other add-on offered by any 3D software, I would say if you aren't going to be doing any heavy simulation, then this add-on is just the way to go with Blender. There are certain limitations to this add-on, which you can check out on GitHub, but the ones I'm about to list here are the most important of them all, which I felt would be worthy to let you know number one limitation is skill and time flip fluid simulator is designed for small to mid scale fluid effects it is designed for physical skills ranging from glass of water to large sections of a beach the simulator is not designed for macro scale phenomena such as accurately simulating the interactions between individual droplets of water it is also not designed for larger scale simulations such as a river network or an entire sea or ocean i hope you got that okay this leads me to my number two which is pro lighting pro lighting studio is an add-on that makes it easy to set up lighting for a single object or collection of objects in blender render engine cycle it also works great for isometric low poly renders or anywhere you need a studio like setup there have been several updates with bug fixes and stability issues the add-on is very stable and it's worth a try my number three is going to be groove six there is groove eight and even groove 10 coming out shortly but hey it's much better to have the older groove six than none at all groove six is a fun way to grow in trees it allows you to build high quality models that are lightweight to render the groove adaptation polygon reduction and unique twig system offers incredible details with very little impact on memory. Blender Groove 6 contains over 40 enhanced newly included presets. It's a robust and easy to use effect. My number 4 is going to be the GR Hair Tool. Hair Tool is an add-on for Blender 2.93 and above. Yeah, that will help you generate haircuts based on 3D curves in a non-destructive way. You can simply generate haircuts with hair tool by using guide mesh or using particle hair interactive grooming by drawing hair strands. Very easy guys, very easy. Number 5 is going to be Blender Archipack. This plugin greatly automates the process of creating architecture elements and speeds up the process. It generates fully parametric meshes which can be editable any time the occasion demands. Okay, I'm planning on giving out free software licenses ranging from Adobe, Nuke plugins, Cinema 4D, Red Giant Packs, Boris Mocha Pro, Maya Addons, um, Silhouette, Lumina AI, and quite a few others. These are the only softwares I can think of for now. And also Houdini, 
short short tutorials not license of daily just tutorials okay if you love this video then subscribe to the channel very much appreciated see you in my next video